so today I'm going to do a period vlog and this is going to be the start of my vlog for the month of April 2016. Um, yeah, so in the next clip you're going to see what I wore for day one. Okay, so today is day one of my period and it is April 18th, 2016. Yesterday I actually saw like a little bit of spotting, so I wore the um, Vita day pad. And then I just used it as an overnight pad because, like, normally I don't get really get night, night flows. Like, there's just, like, a little bit of blood, like, five to seven drops, but really not that much. So I wore this, and I um, put it towards the back instead of the front because of, um, when I'm laying down, my flow usually um, flows downwards because I'm laying down. So, yeah. And then when I woke up, as I predicted, it was just a little bit of blood. And then I want another one actually, the Vita Day Pad. And then at recess, I checked and it was like pretty full, like from the center all the way towards the back and a little bit towards the front. It was pretty full. So then I put on the Maxim Hygiene Ultra Thin Regular, which this is the Maxon Technology one, but just imagine it without the pink core. So I put this on, and then at lunch I checked and um this pad was like full like in the center to the back and like I had pretty bad cramping this morning during first period and so and then I my cramping stopped at um PE class which is second period so my cramping was during first period and then second period stopped and then at lunch I had bad crampings again until fifth period so normally I don't get crampings, but I don't know why this, I'm getting crampings this period. It's really weird. So yeah, I had pretty bad crampings. And so at lunch, I changed into the NatraCare Ultra Pad Super, which looks like this. And then after school, which is right now when I'm filming this um, it is I think it's like 3.15 or something so I just put on my organic cup along with the 7th generation liner I'm trying to use these up as well so yeah hopefully I'm not really getting it took me like 1 minute to put the cup in but it took me like 5 minutes to get it open because I was so tensed up and like I was squishing the cup and that cup is pretty soft so yeah, I had to like take a few de deep breaths and finally got it to open. Hopefully I'm not leaking. So yeah, and then tonight I'm going to wear the organic um, over with heavy flow overnight pad because I want to use these up. And I will update you girls tomorrow. Hey girlies, so quick update. Um, I changed my mind. I'm not going to wear the cup until nighttime anymore my organic cup um, so I'm gonna switch to this um, Vita light tampon because I want to like this is my first time inserting a tampon so I really want to try it out and this is the light one so it doesn't take that long to um, fill it up so I'm just gonna wear this and this is gonna be my first time inserting a tampon but I kind of have a little bit of confidence because I have just inserted a menstrual cup so yeah, I'm going to put this on, and I still have my 7th generation liner on, so I'm not going to put on another one. And this is like my box of used, going to use products. So, yeah. Bye, girls. Hey, girlies. So, I'm back, and I'm about to change again, because, like, the Vita Light Tampon was, like, <clears throat> light absorbency, and I'm currently having a heavy flow right now, so it was, like pretty much soaked up when I took it out and um, I uh, successfully inserted it the first time I tried like literally this was my first time inserting a tampon and I did it so if you're looking for like a beginner tampon I really recommend the Vita light tampons so yeah right now I'm, ab I'm about to change into the 7th generation super long which looks like this it's in the pouch packaging And they have wings. 
Okay, opening a pad with one hand is very hard. Okay, so this is what they look like. So I'm going to change into this and I will update you girls later. Oh, keep in mind this is still um, day one. Hey girlies! So I changed out of my 7th um, generation super long pad. And I just, I have on right now the 7th um, generation um, maxi pad overnight. And this is what it looks like. And it's really comfortable, like it feels... I guess soft against my skin and it doesn't give that like diaper feeling as some people describe it so I think they're quite comfortable so yeah I will update you girls on day two hey girlies it is day two of my pe of my period um, today is April 19th or 20th I'm not sure I think it's the 19th April 19th, 2016, and it's like 6.35 right, a.m. right now, so I'm about to change out of my night pad, which is the 7th generation maxi pad, and it is super comfortable, guys, so yeah. So I think I'm going to put on the, um, the Maxim Hygiene Ultrasyn Regular, which looks like this. I can open it with one hand. Yeah, so it looks like this. I'm going to change into this and then I will update you girls after school. Hey girls, so I'm back and right now it's after school, April 19th, 2016. I finally checked and it's April 19th and it's day two of my period vlog. So this morning I um, wore the Maxim Hygiene Ultra Thin Regular, which um, you girls just saw. And then at school, at recess, I checked in and like the pad was like, I'm an arrow bleeder, which means I bleed like right in the middle. And then like if the middle gets full, I run towards the back or the, my flow runs toward the back. So yeah, the pad was practically full because like... Um, during PE class, which is second period, um, we ran the mile, because on Tuesdays we run mile, so I think that's why my flow was so heavy, so my, um, the maximum pad was pretty much full, but it absorbed everything, it was pretty good, and then I changed into the Emerita day pad, which looks like this, and I kind of have mixed feelings about these, so I'm just going to continue using them to see what um, I think. And then at lunch, I changed into the Maxim Hygiene Maxion Technology Regular, which looks like this. And then I still have it on, and then I will update you girls tonight when I change into my night pad. Okay, girlies, so right now it's night time. It's like um, 7.45, so I'm about to change into my night pad. So I'm going to change into the Maxim Hygiene Ultra Thin Supers, which looks like this. And I really like how like these have like a fan shape wing so excited to try that and I will update you girls tomorrow morning hey girlies so it is day three of my period vlog and it's like seven in the morning right now of April 20th 2016 so last night my night flow wasn't that heavy it was kind of regularish so I think today I'm gonna have a regular flow I'm not sure though so this morning I'm gonna put on the organic moderate flow pad. This is what it looks like. And then I will update you girls after school. Hey girlies! So I'm back and right now it's after school. It's like um it's 3 55 p.m. and yeah, so um I've learned something new about my cycle today 
and that is um, like this morning I told you girls that I wore the organic moderate flow pad which you girls just saw in the last clip and um, I've learned that there, like the first 30 minutes of my day my period won't come and then 30 minutes later it'll continue its regular flow again so um, I put on the moderate flow and then like at school before passing or before second period I went to the bathroom and I was leaking because like I was having a heavy flow so I leaked out of the organic moderate flow pads so yeah so I've learned that my flow doesn't start until like 30 minutes <clears throat> 30 to 40 minutes after I wake up so yeah I ended up leaking so then I put on the uh, natural care ultra extra super because I want to try these out and then so yeah I wore this Oh, and this is what it looks like and then um, at recess I didn't change and then at lunch I changed into the Fida day pad because like I didn't know what, to, what else to put on because like I didn't know if my foot was going to be heavier or lighter for the rest of the day so I just put this on this is what it looks like <clears throat> and then I will update you girls tonight with my night pad okay so right now I'm about to change into my night pad it is 8 p.m. right now so I'm gonna put on the natural care ultra extra long and I'm gonna try these out tonight this is what it looks like they have like a real a wider back um, than the f compared to the front which I really like because like at night my flow tends to go towards the back because I'm laying down so yeah and right now I'm having like really bad bloatiness which sucks because it feels like I'm carrying like a big heavy uh, balloon so I guess I have to deal with it and then I will update you girls on day four okay so right now it's after school of Jan or January April 21st 2016 today is a Thursday so I'm just gonna do a last update because my period has ended <clears throat> so this morning I checked on my night pad which was the natural care ultra extra long and it was like really 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 light so then I wore the natural care long liner which this is what it looks like and then like right before I left for school um, I checked and there was like brown spotting on the liner so that's how I knew my period has ended it was only like four days this month usually it's like five to seven but it was only four days this month and then so I continued wearing that and then I just continued it wearing it all throughout the school day because on Thursdays we go home early so I didn't really change so yeah I just wore the natural Carolina all day so <clears throat> yeah that's that and then just um, like a minute ago I checked on it and as I predicted my period never came it just was continuously having brown spotting so now it has like officially ended um, so I think this is we have come to the end of my period vlog for the month of April 2016 if you enjoy these types of videos just comment down below and like I might do like a period experience video every like after I upload a vlog um, to talk about like how my period was this month and stuff so if you want that just comment down below and then like this video and I guess I'll see you girls next time bye